Good morning, good morning, good morning. It's your buddy Mikey here at SD Fish and Sips. I'm coming through beautiful Mission Bay. Sunday, January 16th, 2022. We're going by the Hyatt Islandia Hotel over by the West Mission Bay Drive Bridge. Underneath it, gonna go through Quivera Basin and the Bay Barge and then make our way out to La Jolla for the day for some fishing out in La Jolla. Hopefully a yellowtail, maybe a white sea bass, maybe a halibut, calico bass, gulpin. Those are all on the mix, all legal fish to keep this time of the year. Winter fishing, it's uh, deeper water, colder water, deeper fish. Woo -wee. Just pure beauty. Cruising through Mission Bay. Love it, stand up style on a solo skip. Looking like a nice, flat, glassy, calm day. Still some surf in the water. That's been the name of the game lately out in the ocean. The surf's been pumping. I've been flying my drone, getting some drone shots. You can check out my stuff on Newsbreak app. Download the Newsbreak app. I'll put that link in the description below. And if you download that app using my info, I get some money off of that. So all these different little ways to help me out, make some money, keep this dream alive. We're coming out of the five mile an hour zone right now here. So now we can mash. Looks like it's gonna be an easy exit cause it's a slack high tide. It gets sketchier when the tide's moving a lot through the jetty entrance, but it look, doesn't look bad right now. We're doing about 12 miles an hour, 12 and a half. If I adjust my positioning up forward a little bit, it goes about 13, a little faster. 30 to 45 minutes before we're in La Jolla. Woo, let's go solo skip it. San Diego solo skip, fish and sips. Woo, little lumpy right there. Rolling in off the jetty. But wow, look at the fog, kind of misty back there. I don't know what that was. towards the spot. I'm going to go ahead and my bait tank on. Battery connects all good. See how the water is coming out and the water is flowing. Let's, just, let's do it. Feels like I got something. We'll see if it's a mackerel or not. Yeah, not what I'm looking for. Let's see what we got. Feels like a rockfish on the sabiki. Maybe it's a sculpin. That would be sweet. Yeah, whitefish. Okay. I just checked. 
white fish season is not open. Gotta get, this guy's gotta go back. See you later. I thought sculpin and, and whitefish were open, but they're not. It says it's closed for boat bait dangling. All right, as I'm cruising around looking for bait, I'll go ahead and throw the classic out, the Nomad. This is the one my buddy Jacob gave me. Thank you, Jacob. On that TLD. Saber. back there we're gonna make our way this way nobody else out empty day maybe we'll get a lucky hookup all right i was cruising along trolling and then i marked some fish towards the bottom feels like some mackerel that's what i'm looking for Let's see what we got on that runkle coming up from the deep yep Nice. Three mackerel. There we go. I got three mackerel. Two big greenbacks here and a Spanish. I got the bait tank fired up. Got my little D hooker right here. Two greenbacks and a Spanish. There we go. Add some water to it by hand. I'm gonna keep trolling, try to make some more bait before tying up my dropper loop. Coming towards the inside, the reserve line of La Jolla. Just trolling hard. You got the Nomad out there. I got a couple pieces of live bait I'm gonna drop down on the bottom up here. Whale watching tours on the kayaks this time of the year. I haven't seen any whales out in La Jolla, but you never know when they're gonna pop up. So I'm gonna keep my eyes open on my fish finder and then go to some spots that I've fished to before, spots with structure. I'm here inside La Jolla, I'm gonna go ahead tie on a dropper loop. I go ahead and use mono, 40 pound mono here. I'm not gonna waste my fluorocarbon because the fish are down deeper. It shouldn't make a difference. I'm gonna put a swivel on the top, a swivel clip on the bottom, and then I got a ring circle hook. That's what we're gonna work with, dropper loop. Winter fishing here in San Diego, La Jolla. Okay, so I'm gonna tie a swivel, barrel swivel. This one's rated at 175 pounds. San Diego jam knot. I like to do about seven turns. Jam knot, and I'm gonna come down maybe 24 inches. Come across another 24. Make a, a loop, three turns around the outside, and then through the middle, bam. And I take my hook. I got the pliers. All right, I got my ring circle hook. I'm gonna put this through. Palomar knot for the hook. All right, got that on there. The loop's gonna be about halfway up. Okay, next up, put the swivel clip on the bottom. I'll grab a weight. All right. Bringing in the Nomad tie the dropper loop on the TLD. Okay. I like these pliers because they cut through the braid nice. Cut the Nomad off. Tie on the dropper loop. This is winter fishing in San Diego right here. Live mackerel, big live mackerel on the dropper loop. We'll see what's going on in the shallower water. I'm in 70 feet right now. Same thing, jam knot. I got that. 
grab a weight from the inside. Sun's coming out, yellow tail gonna come out and play. What do we got here, 10 ounce weight, torpedo sinker, something going on in the bottom right here. We're gonna go ahead, I got my ring circle hook on my dropper loop. Take one of these greenback mackerels, nose hook it. Drop it down, couple cranks off the bottom, clicker on. All right, good to go on the live bait. Got the dropper loop down. Now next up, I'm gonna take the sabiki off and play around with the jig, a plastic. I'm gonna go with the big Rasta plastic. Okay, go ahead and cut this off and tie a leader on for my plastics and irons. What I'm gonna do is a barrel swivel to the same mono to a clip. I've been liking to use these clips right here. Don't have any more. All right, there I got it. I got the uh, Master Bass tube bait, big Rasta on the Runkle Spinny. Got a 40 pound mono leader with a little barrel swivel. Keep my eyes out, drop this down when I see some marks. Let's check on the dropper loop, see if it's got any kelp caught on it. I got some kelp up on top right here. A little bit of bait in the water here. Uh, towards this top, I just saw a mackerel. No, my mackerel is still good. There it is. Let's make sure that the hook not back into his mouth like that. That's how you want it, like that. Just chill. All right, I'm kind of slow trolling this big Pacific greenback mackerel on the dropper loop. I'm gonna check on it. Make sure that the hook's set right in the nose. There's no kelp or grass on it. I haven't been marking anything. I'm in 120 feet of water right now. Looking good. That's my dropper loop right there. I appreciate that. Yeah, I mean, there's such a beautiful place out here in La Jolla. Special, special time right now. It's always something if the fishing's slow that you got the whales. I saw some out front of uh, Point Loma on Friday. That's cool, got the whale watching boat right there. That guy was saying he got a shot of me with the whale going down. We just had one whale come through. Let's see if we got any more. Still trolling, I got that mackerel out right now. I'm seeing some whale sprays in the distance. There's it right there. Going down, fluking. A little bit shallower than where, where I'm at, where I'm fishing. That's gonna do it. That's gonna do it all for here in La Jolla. Bring up the dropper loop off the bottom. I didn't get any bites, I didn't mark any fish. I'll go fish PB a little bit in front of Crystal Pier, some of the sunken ships. Maybe drop down for some halibut. That Spanish mackerel. Low in La Jolla still. The whales are here, that's always cool, that's always fun. I'd rather have the yellow tail though. Both is the best. down. So 
check that out. I went to check my bait. It's got some bite marks. I don't know what kind of that might be halibut. It's not like a halibut rake, but we'll see. Making the approach back in, and there's some waves. I gotta be careful. It's breaking hard against the South Jetty Ocean Beach side. Let's go. I think that was one of the bigger sets, but I can go fast on these waves 13 and a half, 14 miles an hour. Go low scale, that's how we're doing it. There's one boat coming out. All in, here we go. 15 miles an hour, boat left. So now I got a clean entry. Here's his wake. Easier to deal with it out here than on the inside. That's all for today. Launched out of here, Mission Bay this morning, about 7.30, cruised up to La Jolla, saw some dolphins, saw some whales, made some mackerel, caught a white fish on the sabiki, put the dropper loop down with the mackerel on it all throughout La Jolla, trolled the Nomad, didn't mark any fish, fish in front of Pacific Beach with the Mackerel on the dropper loop and got hit by something. There's some teeth marks when I brought it back up, but no, no hookups. Then I made, made my way into kind of a sketchy entry back into the jetty. Do some waves. Saw a couple people gave them the report on the water. Thanked them for watching the channel and done for the day.